Hey guys, Graham here and welcome to the Tattoo Apprenticeship video series. I've put together 22 videos where I think I'm going to cover pretty much everything you possibly need to know about apprenticeships before you go and get one. Um, if you want to start from the beginning you can click here, if not and you just want to know what this video is about then carry on watching and at the end I'll put a full list of all the videos and if there's any other topics that catch your attention you can just click on the link at the end and it will take you to the next video you want to see. So this video is going to be about um, what you will need for your apprenticeship supplies and stuff like that. So. Um, well, it's not just supplies, there is other things. The first thing you're going to need to do, I did mention this in the last video, is you're going to need to pay for your um, your hepatitis uh, shot. So you're going to need that straight away um, before you start because if you're cleaning tubes or touching anything that is contaminated slightly with blood, even if you do have gloves on, there's still a slight chance of um, you know a bit of transference onto your skin. So you do need jabs before you start doing anything. Um, so that's the first thing you're gonna to need to pay for, um, and then obviously your first day training, but uh, the shop sometimes pays for that, and it probably won't cost you um, that much to do. It's not, it's not too expensive. Um, but supplies and things you will need for your apprenticeship. Now, to begin with, you don't need anything. Literally nothing. They won't want you to have a tattoo machine if you already have one, or you have, or you've bought a kit or something stupid like that off of eBay. One, why the hell did you do that? throw it away, straight away, it's a bunch of crap, or sell it, no don't sell it, burn it, burn it, that's what it deserves to have done with it, burn it, but um, they're rubbish, they really are, and you can't use them like in a professional shop, because they're such crap, um, so what you want to do is you want to uh, just start off completely with nothing, just go in, they'll tell you when you need to buy stuff, um, you know, obviously it varies on how long you, it's going to be before you actually start tattooing, but when you do start tattooing, you'll need a machine. Um, with my apprentices, I just said to them, you know, I recommended machines to them and um, told them what to get kind of thing. And uh, they, they just uh, got a machine. I let them use my clipboard, foot switch, power supply, all that sort of stuff. So um, you will need that eventually, uh, but you know, not until you actually properly start tattooing. You know, most tattooists will just let their apprentices use their station, their whole setup. Um, the shop supplies everything other than um, the, like I say, foot switch, clipboard, and power supply and machines. So, well that's in general anyway, some shops are a bit tighter, but usually that's the case. Um, so that's all you're going to need. And uh, yeah, so, you know, just to start off with, it's going to be, it's going to be free and you're going to then, you know, need to buy a machine. Machines, like, you can buy good, really, really good machines for like 150, like, uh, that's English pounds, so I'm um, not sure how, how much it is in dollars. Usually stuff in America is cheaper though, so it's all good. Um, but you know, they range from around, yeah, like um, 150 for like, a, for like a good machine, all the way up to like 500. You know, you can, you can go way above that, sometimes for like custom builds and, uh, you know, specialist machines. But you don't need to. So, um, machines wise, you're gonna need um, something, uh, well, you know, liner, shader, colorer, um, color, color packer sort of thing, but you know you can you can get away with uh, little shortcuts. And I'm going to do a video later on in this series where I kind of go over machines and kind of you know like what you would probably need to buy uh, without actually telling people what to buy because I don't want scratches watching my videos and picking up machines and tattooing their mates in their bedroom. So, um, but yeah, I'll kind of give you an outline of kind of how you can make things a little bit cheaper if your tattooist is telling you to buy three machines. You can get around it. So um, yeah, that's that's just coming in a little bit later on in the series. So yeah, that's pretty much all you're going to need for your apprenticeship. Um, like I say, they will tell you uh, in a bit in advance when you need to start buying stuff, so I wouldn't worry about that too much. And uh, basically, they're free to do, usually. So if this video helps you out, don't forget to drop me a like, because it really does help me out back. Um, and uh, leave any comments, because I always reply to all my comments. I'm here to help, and um, I'm always happy to answer questions. Um, and subscribe if you're not already. And uh, yeah, other than that, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll catch you all soon.